that championship. Honestly, I have no... You got him over the course of it, but it's all green on the feed. Light it up is Breach. Yeah, I mean, Priest, uh, he, he finds a timing. He's going to find three, so and he makes it all four. Priest, uh, light it up here early for Boston Breach. He gets a great timing through connector, able to flank P1. That's where Linz just pushes through from, so he finds the timing, able to get a free couple of kills, then ready for all of the spawns which leads Breach to 17 seconds into map control. And you'd love to get him going early. Is it got that lead? Can they get this break? Linz still there, one HP to back and forth battle, but this is exactly what Boston Breach want to do. They get him out at least for now. Not getting any time if you're Breach, but they get him out of the hard point. They'll maintain that minimal lead. Still just kind of waiting behind Awakening with some lovely shots of the back tractors. They're just Lurk is there from accuracy as he develops it on the pinch. And now the collapse starts to come in as you try to make the play through. Lin's finding some clutch kills. Viv is still inside. It's awkward there as he swaps. He'll get caught. It's another break now for Breach. Yeah, great break there. And you try to call it. Yeah, accuracy spawns all the way out Palace before the next hill pops, right? So he basically gets a free pinch due to the spawn. Uh, it, it, he's able to find one, but Breach, they get the back for Boston Breach. So pinch, the game's going to be a little bit weird here. Just this, <laughs> sort of this question of who's going to stay up. Nice shots by Slasher. On the opposite side, it's Priest, and he finds two off a of spawn for Rocker. So this fight all over. Them. So Rocker gonna take control. Linz is on three in a row, but here comes Slasher and the rest of Breach trying to break this hill. Well, it was a frustrating moment for him. It looks like it's continuing as he's able to get the only kill, but the rest of the team going to drop. Linz's streak continues. Now up to four, getting frying his way across the map. Everybody else in the squad basically right around even. He's trying to get out, trying to finesse. Teammate's gonna come through. Trophy goes away, but the kill will be there. A seed then. Lovely flurry of headshots right over to Slasher, but Wake will put him down. There wasn't much time earned on this point early, but now with these final 30 seconds, we'll see what they can... This time we'll see if maybe they can hold. Not going to happen is right through the front comes Vivid, who gets two. He kind of stomped Breach right out of it. But the different last time he was Breach that pushed through, but they end up flipping him all the way out. Let's see if Rocker can kind of keep them trapped in Palisade, but it's Breach who just got broken. They're trying to answer back, likely thinking about the next... Dark, 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 Still on with Priesta. Yeah, Seeing if he can maybe work towards streaks, but he's almost double positive. He's not slowed down since that 4-0 start. I mean, it's the problem of not only the, 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 the game score, it's also the clock. You have 40 seconds yeah. left. So, I mean, you would have to play some perfect COD moving forward. Plus a cruise missile still to work with on the side of Boston Breach. If we go to that disposition time and time again, a chance here though for Minnesota, but Breach, they're just going to go on this rotation as a 30 bomb is in for a seam. Priesta one kill away. And just think about how he erupted, right? Because it was all Priest early. It's like when he was 15 and 7, Everyone else was basically even. Then he just goes off. It's a monster map. Closer, and they do it almost instantly. And then, yeah, it was a great lootly bodied as his head comes clean off. Luscious shots there from Snoopy. Oh, my Lord, he's got a cannon. Yes, he does. Two beamers in a row. And now he still has time to work with. Deddy is up. But Awakening has not rotated. He is still sitting mid-tank. Vivid looking over him. And again, Snoopy was kind of your B player. You're not playing around the site. He was trying to play in a forward position, gets caught in round one. Did he throw it too deep again? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, it's not in front of the barricade. So you have that, that TDM, he can't plant. And now it's on Vivid to stay alive. Live, 20 to go. With the priest to death, things probably got too difficult. Yeah, Linz is playing this well with the rival, just trying Whoa. to buy time. 15 seconds though. Now it's down to Snoopy versus Vivid. There's a slide out of Snoopy! Oh God! Yeah. Accuracy's got position and maybe find another just on the other tank. They're dancing around each other. The streak will end for Snoopy. 2v4 for a moment there into a two versus three. Now it's a 2v2 and Bomb is being planted. Linz doesn't see him on it. Bomb is down. And there we go with Doopy here. He's the man working B Street trying to find an opening because if you're Priester and Slasher, you're kind of waiting on him. Waiting on a pick, but that is not going to happen. We'll see. His big weight just kind of waiting. 
Can they go faster? That's the question. Breach of, again, it's been always just down to 15, 20 seconds, but there we go. There's the pace right around a minute, but Linz, so good in this spot, does it again with the first blood. Almost finds this second, but a quick trade. Okay, bring it back to a three versus three, but still again, just seems to be a little indecisive. So far, just kind of two lopsided maps. No, it really has been. It Use him for a second if he back down. You try to push through if you're Snoopy, but you're gonna get caught. Priest is still all the way <laughs> towards Palace. I find he kills. They have not been able to deal with him yet, but they've still had people on B this entire time. So despite the fact he's been getting kills, Priest is out. Yo, accuracy, Vivid, going huge. Now a chance here for Rocker to find another tick and maybe the round. Second player has gotten a cross pressure on them to try and break. Shot should be coming through as well. Awakening Lin's able to hit. Team kill comes through. That's going to be all four dead again. That'll be the round. It's a lightning strike early on. It's been a like each time. Like they, they did not have a lot that they could work with. Now though, you get several kills. You're starting to collapse. You got three people sort of hitting back ass, trying to isolate number seven on the map, but you do get two big kills if you're a rocker. Still, you're through if you're breach. Maybe they're gonna sniff a. Eh? They're starting to move close, starting to rally the action here. Over to your second objective as Seam has got onto it. Yeah, three in a row for Snoopy. Looking them out of the defense has done enough if you are a rocker. There's always been enough bodies to retake this or get the one person clear into another two person hit now one and four and asim and snoopy looking to push on through awakening to the double child he will drop but one more person always one more body to make sure you hold this won't extend there with snoopy no but you got nobody over towards b accuracy though able to find the two opening kills so you're gonna put two players on this but they're the last two players on the Same result is gonna come through here he was able to find one and he had accuracy chasing him, but he's allowed his team to get the time and now work up the map. I mean, you put Snoopy and accuracy in a 100-meter race inside the game. That's that's not close, Joe. No, it is not. <laughs> it's very, very different. But with that point, having to try and get across, and this is the one where they struggle to sort of disrupt and make it messy at times. You get through and find a pair of kills. You're right back into the hard point if you are a rocker. Lin's ready and holding, breathing room for Rocker, lead change looming in the wind. And it's just like asim has been kind of their, their fireball. If you talk about our flasher, at least through for one, but right into the point is Rocker and gets a bit messier here, more, a little more quickly is Rocker on the aggressive. Yeah, great shots by Vivid, and that's just it. Yeah, they find the openings, you spawn out if you were Breach, and that is not the point, it'll be Slasher. Outs are trying to hold, it'll be Priest of the Snap is there. He's got some help as well, and he's able to stay up. So far, definitely looking better than our last point. No, it is, yeah, it's staying clean. There we go. Lenses, they try to get ready for this next point. Vivid's route ends up paying off. He's able to take out Priest, and we'll see if he can keep it going. Minnesota, it started pretty well. It's sort of falling apart a bit. You're down 30, you're in the point, you're trying to bring it back in this and maybe close out the series. Okay, 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 he he awesome. wants, he wants, he wants. Right, right. He's in a the tunnel. One of the first things we heard kind of with Rocker, the last point, let's make sure haven't been close. Map one. You love the timing for Breach. You love the P. Okay, you hate the timing for Breach. I take it back, you hate the timing. As soon as he gives it up, he gets ripped. Then one for all. Don't throw away your life, Snoopy. Good job just getting damage in, buying time. Breach is gonna lose a fight to send it forward. Accuracy the pistol. Somehow I'm gonna get two. Snoopy now left alone. The Renetti's nearly do it all. Four Rocker. Within games. As bombs start to get planted towards B. Priest and Snoopy clearing everything. Backing up is going to be Rocker. Lin's awakening. Reverse Priest and Snoopy. Here we go. Oh, Lin's able to stay up. Yeah, looked like the knees. They were trying to need a corner instead of the player on the bomb. So didn't know he was there. Now, there maybe the rotation. Yeah, very quickly here. And Slasher's going to find the first blood. Instead of him dropping by an eight like we've seen at times, the numbers are going the way of Breach. A nice shot by Slasher in this power position, putting damage in. And now Snoopy's on the flank, and he's just able to jump over the wall. So it's all down to Linz. There we go. Oh, Linz, I think, got two of them there, but... Qualifiers have, have been great.